with mighty motivation, I get this my all. Self-reflection. Yes, it's about that time to look in that mirror. It's about that time to reach for your energy source and have a true understanding of your own personal life values and motivations. No, we are not perfect. So there will come a time to come back and look in that mirror. Self-reflection is a time to be honest about what we need to do to improve. It can be our own personality. It can be our relationships. It can be our job. It can even be our mindset. Change the way that you think. To change the way that you feel. To change your own atmosphere. It's about that time to stop being judgmental. But instead, let's start holding our own selves accountable for our own actions. How can we see greatness if we are not willing to create greatness within ourselves? How can we seek a loving person if we do not truly love ourselves first? How do you seek motivation when we ourselves are not even motivated? How do you seek the real deal when indeed we are not even the real deal? And even sometimes falsified. Yes, falsified. Some of us seek a good game, but truly do not know how to play the game. And sometimes it is what it is. Just a game. When will we set the standards of true realness without prejudice? When will you give yourself 100% of you? What happened to the standards of self-love? The standards of consistency. The standards of integrity. On my journey of self-reflection, I reflect, I analyze, I start repairing all inaccuracies and all inconsistencies and any misunderstandings that I might have presented, that I may take all responsibility for all of my actions, I can acknowledge my own wrongdoing as I correct them. My greatest path to my motivation would be the door to my own self-reflection. I live to be great. Therefore, there is no other way than to create my own greatness. This is Ron Spates, and I live for greatness.